Hello everyone, today we're having a look at Aeoptron's latest super portable mount, the Sky Hunter. The Sky Hunter comes in three versions. Um, you've got the Altaz only, the EQ Altaz, and the EQ Altaz with iPower. They are essentially all the same. The Sky Hunter mount itself is this bit. Uh, this bit is the same across the three mounts. Here we're looking at the EQ Altaz with the iPower. <coughs> Excuse me. So it includes the EQ base. That's this piece. And the iPower scope, which is this piece. Of course, they all have the bar and counterweight. Um, so what's pretty unique about this mount is that obviously it is a really compact, portable, lightweight mount. Um, but what's really amazing is that it's, it's got uh, Wi-Fi built in and through Sky Safari or uh, through an upcoming iOptrons app, you can essentially go to this mount, um, which is a massive improvement over their SkyGuider Pro. Included with the mount, you also have the tripod. So that's the essentially the same tripod as what came with the SkyGuider Pro, this uh, steel tripod really good, but uh, it includes uh, this piece on top. So that's all part of the package. Um, so now we'll have a, a go and uh, we'll put it all together. We'll start by the EQ base. If I wanted, I could set it to uh, latitude here. We'll just put something at random. That. Once we've fitted the EQ base, we can mount the Sky Hunter mount itself. Very easily just slides in place. You lock that in and you're pretty much good to go. Here we've got the iPolar version. And they've got a clever little trick uh, for the polyscope. It just snaps into place here. And you can just tighten it. You've got the USB connector here on this side. So you can simply um, plug that into the computer perform your, your polar alignment once it's done you can i guess leave it on or you could just remove it and uh, you're good to go next is the shaft and counterweight pretty straightforward always make sure you get your toe saver here boom and off you go. And that is pretty much it for the Sky Hunter mount, just setting it all up. As you can see, it's very, uh, it's very straightforward, very neat little setup, extremely portable. And again, you know, you you can go to uh, with this, which is, uh, which is really uh, a, a massive, massive bonus. And um, some people will be wondering whether William Williams Optics latitude base that they designed for the SkyGather Pro will work on this, but unfortunately it won't. Even though it'll, it'll fit, um, it's cause it's got the same fitting here, you basically are too limited um, in the travel here. 
to um, you know just to set it up at, at, at appropriate latitudes. Um, we've tried really taking it apart, removing all the uh, the bits inside, but at the end of the day, you're limited by by this travel range. And because it's mounted sort of the other way around, um, Iotron's mount the, the, their system is sort of the other way around. Um, you would have if we put that next to each other, you would have to uh, to have to have that really sort of vertical, and and you just simply can't. Um, so that's uh, that's quite unfortunate, really, because that was such a, a fantastic base. Um, so. Yep, there you go. Um, we've got these uh, available on the website. Uh, all three versions, we have them in stock right now. Um, and you can visit us at proastros.com. We'll leave a li link in the description box below. And we look forward to, um, to yeah, really getting to, to try this mount. Uh, it's, it's a nice little it's a nice little portable mount it's going to be uh, it's, it's going to be really uh, i think a great success for iotron here um yeah if you have any questions feel free to leave them below and thank you for watching clear skies